losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something that'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Aldrid Paul Creations. So today is another review on how to determine the conveyor length. So based on this rolled conveyor, we can determine the length without stretching it and measuring it by using formula. So how to determine the conveyor length? So first, determine the diameter 31 so based on the arrows it is where you measure the one so based on this picture measure we measure the d1 equals to one foot next is determine the diameter d2 so based on the arrows it is where you get or to measure the diameter D2 so based on this uh, picture D2 is measured which is equals to 5 feet next is uh, determine the number of years so in L so based on the arrow it is where you measure the number of years in L so by counting uh, 1 2 3 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So based on my counting, NL equals to 16. So number of years equals to 16. So then, with this given data that we got, we can now determine the conveyor length. So based on this date, given data, we can now get the conveyor length or determine the conveyor length by using this formula. Conveyor length LC equals phi times quantity of D1 plus D2 times NL over 2. So calculating the L sub C, so substitute the given data to the formula. So Phi, which is equal to 3.1416 times quantity of D1, which is 1, and D2 is 5, so times NL is 16, divide 2. So based uh, on the data, so computing, LC equals 150.8 feet. So therefore, based on this data given, we get the length of conveyor on this picture, the road conveyor in this picture, which is the length of 150.8 feet. So, summary of conveyor length calculation. So, or how to determine the conveyor length. So, based on the picture, the data gave, uh, we got is day one equals one foot. D2 equals 5 feet, number of layers equals 16. So we substituted earlier uh, with the formula of convergent L sub C equals 5 times D1 plus D2 times in L divided by 2. So we got the length of conveyor is 150.8 feet. So this is how when you, you get a uh, rolled conveyor without switching and measure the length so by using this formula so just remember conveyor length formula l sub c equals pi times quantity of d1 plus d2 times nl divide 2 this is d1 is the diameter 1 which is the inside diameter d2 which is the outside diameter and nl is number of years which is the how many layers in the roll conveyor so as you can see on this picture and the arrows this is where you get uh, the data is D1, D2, and NL. So that's how 
to determine the conveyor length or that's how the conveyor length calculation of this sample uh, picture, a rolled conveyor. So thank you for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe my channel Eldred Paul Creations and hit the notification bell so that you can get some videos update for my channel. Thank you.